We're going to be heading out into the plaza next. From this point on, we're actually going through original doorways and heading out into the real core and center of their community. This would have been the heart of the community. The building surrounding it and at the center of their entire community was their great kiva, their religious structure, um, the area where important community-wide ceremonies and activities would have taken place. This is one of the things that Aztec Ruins is famous for, is its great kiva, its reconstructed great kiva. Earl Morris originally excavated the great kiva in 1921 the Great Kiva had pretty much disappeared. The weathering away, most of everything that had been excavated had fallen in or worn away. The Park Service decided they had an option of either backfilling it and burying it or rebuilding it. They de determined the best thing to do would be to reconstruct it and they asked Earl Morris to come back and lead that reconstruction. Most of what you see here Earl Morris had evidence of when he reconstructed it. For example, this that he termed an altar did have this configuration of paint. It had this white circle and these, these wooden posts had been burned. So what Earl Morris tried to do was reconstruct it based on what he was finding. He didn't really add anything. They would have entered the same way we would on stairs coming into the north and the south entryway. There's a set of stone steps behind our wooden steps that would have been the reconstructed stairway they would have used. Great Kivas would have been community-wide ceremonial locations. This place probably could have held certainly hundreds and hundreds of people participating in the ceremonies. In most Great Kivas, you'll find this antechamber to the north. You may find a room or two attached to that but I'm not aware of any other great kivas that actually have an entire encircling room. For every opening here, there's a separate room with walls dividing it. Some of the walls were as much as six feet tall. He did see these series of indentations that had wooden logs put in here, at least as tall tall as the lower portion of the doorway there. What makes up a typical great kiva are the four pillars which would have been used to hold up the roof, a central firebox, and these vaults, floor vaults. Those are probably the one thing in great kivas that, that caused the most question. We don't know what these were for. One theory is that they may have had boards put across them and used as floor drums. If you danced on those boards, they'd have made a drumming sound. The two vaults aren't of equal size, so they may have made different sounds. Could have been a lot of other things too. We just don't really know what those vaults were used for. There wasn't a whole lot of stuff found in them, so it's hard to determine their purpose. One of the unique things, or unusual things too, is the way these pillars were constructed. This alternating stone and wood layering. Another interesting fact, and Earl Morris didn't find this until he came back to reconstruct the Great Kiva, were these limestone discs. Those were, a set of four of those were found under each pillar. And they're not a local stone. It's limestone, so they would again have to have gone a long way away to get that stone and then to shape it in those circles and, and put under there. Just one more indication of the, the value they put into this site and how important it was to use the best material and the finest workmanship to construct their, their center. By the late 1200s, here at Aztec, just like in most of the rest of the Four Corners, the people had decided they couldn't live here any longer and they headed off into other areas. Down to south in Arizona to where the Hopi Mesas are, south of Gallup to the Zuni Pueblo, and out along the Rio Grande between Albuquerque and north of Santa Fe. Joining people that were already living there and ultimately developing into the Pueblo people that still retain the kind of lifestyle 
and a close connection to these sites.